Welcome back to Fallout 1.5 Resurrection. I managed to fix the issue that was plaguing me in the last episode where the game would just basically freeze every time the enemy was taking their turn, so that's good. Now I'm kind of at a difficult spot where I need to figure out how to take on Alexa and her group of mercenaries. There's three ways I can think of to do that. One is to pass time and try to complete that, uh, like, delivery message quest, and hopefully I get something good out of it. I kind of doubt I'm going to get anything good out of it, because the person, like, straight up told me they don't really have anything. But, we'll see. Maybe they'll give me their shotgun. So I think I can do that, and hope for a miracle. Or I can kill some of the mercenaries around here that aren't with Alexa. Hopefully I can get them kind of separate from the group, and therefore I might only have to take out one or two of them, and then I could perhaps take their weapons or sell their equipment to buy weapons. Or I can just continue on to the next town, and just level up and get better equipment, and then come back here. Uh, I think I'm going to start with the less, the least lethal and extreme thing, which is, which is I'm just going to complete that quest and, and see what I get from it. I don't want to go crazy killing the mercenaries before they've actually tried to attack me because it might make the people in town hate me. And I don't really want to continue on right now because it just feels bad to leave this place unfinished. So since it apparently I can't rest anywhere in this entire town and there is no, like... There's no motels or anything around as far as I can tell. The only way I can think of to pass time is to just go to the overworld map and just do this. And that's why it's daytime, by the way, because I did this for a second just to see how fast it would pass time, and the answer is pretty dang fast. All right, there we go. Uh, let's pop over to the south side. It has been a day, they should have a letter. I'm gonna have to go deliver it, unfortunately. Hopefully I don't have to go back and forth too many times. Okay. Hey, so I'm done with the reply for Adam. He hands you a letter. Don't think I have no idea about the great risk you're taking for me. The wasteland is an unpredictable place. <coughs> I... Wait a second. Samuel bends down and loosens a... Um... What the hell does that say? A porquette block? Uncovers a small stash. With extreme caution, he picks up one stim pack, which he gives to you. Hide it well. Julian's goons unscrupulously confiscate all meds. I've been saving it for a rainy day, but you need it more now. Thanks. I mean, it's worth a decent amount of money, but I really just need a freaking weapon. Alright. I'll go deliver it. Hey, woofer. I'm just waiting for that random encounter. <coughs> it's gonna happen. Someday. I don't actually remember who the hell Adam was. Are you Adam? Oh, yeah, you are Adam. Oh, I'll be nice. Even though I really do need the money. Uh, did you manage to deliver my message? Yes, and your brother immediately wrote your reply. He eagerly examines his brother's letter. Thank you so much. I thought I'd never hear from them again. Here, take this. He hands you 50 caps. I know it's not much, but I'm afraid that's all I have. Um, that's alright. Take care. Welp. That did not lead to a weapon, did it? Damn. Did they actually give me the caps? Did they? I don't think they did. I guess because I said that's alright, meaning... Nah, you can keep the money. Fair enough. Alrighty then. Hmm. Again, I don't want to continue on to set it. Just yet. I guess I'm gonna try to kill some mercenaries. They're not attacking me, but... At least... <laughs> at least I'll go attack, um... What the hell's his name? Leonard? Well, I mean, Leonard isn't alive anymore, but I guess I'll go attack Alexa's... Mercenaries? Since they will, after all, try to kill me as soon as she starts to try to kill me. Oh god, it's nighttime. Fuck me. 
All right, let's turn that brightness back up. Okay, let's see if I can find some mercenaries that are kind of out of the way, like these two. Uh, three. They don't seem to have weapons. I mean, they don't seem to have guns. So that gives me quite an advantage because I can run pretty far with all my action points and all. Hoping this thug. Oh, that is a mercenary, even though they look different. I think they're going to try to attack me too. Okay, let's save and see how the heck this is going to work. What do I need? Like 600 caps, I think, to uh, afford that pistol back on the south side? I could maybe get like a couple hundred, I think, by selling my two skin packs, but it wouldn't be enough. I'd prefer not to sell them, unless I have to. Alright, Woofer, just you and me. Let's do this. Oh, Christ. There's another one there. That's a lot of mercenaries. Hmm. Uh, plan B. Plan B2. Let me see if I can just, like, snipe this one off. See if I can snipe her from here. I don't think anyone will really notice. At least none of the mercenaries. I think I'm far enough away. I'm not even in range. Still not in range. Either that or I'm just blocked by the barrel. Okay. Um, she's melee. Let's slow her down. Okay. Now, who's coming for me? Uh-oh. That mercenary moved. But if it's just that mercenary, that's fine. Two mercenaries? I can absolutely take them on. Yeah. Alright, that's fine. How's her health? Wounded. Okay. Hmm. Let's go for the head. Not dead, but she's got to be close. Almost dead, yeah. Alright. Oh, damn it, I thought she'd stay on the ground longer. Did she just use a stim? She did! Get him, Woofer. Yeah, just two mercenaries. This is great. Now I just need to actually stay alive. Oh, shit. I got a third one. Okay, okay. So, if I need to move... To get some range on these people, I should move this way, because this way has no new mercenaries, so I shouldn't attract more attention. But I've got a little bit of time, let's try to take her out first. Uh, she's almost dead, so I might as well just hit her in the torso. Seriously? Ten hit points. More damage, and she's still not dead. Okay. No, don't hit Woofer. Asshole. I like the pain, she says, as she dies. <laughs> How's Woofer doing, by the way? I don't know how many hit points you have wounded. Alright, not too bad. <coughs> hmm. Let's go for you. Damn it. Alright, it's time to move. Yeah, knock him to the floor. Nice, Woofer. Ow. Oh, there's just three hit points, actually. That wasn't bad. See, I want to play it super safe and just run away, but then that's going to leave Woofer here all alone. I can't do that. I'm going to shoot you in the eyes. Oh, Christ. That didn't look good. No, once again, that looked worse than it actually was. I was only hit for five points of damage. No, Mutt was... Um, Woofer was critically hit. A serious wound is inflicted. No. I just pushed you. I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. Severely wounded. Shit. Woofer can't die. If Woofer dies, it's basically like I died. and I'm going to have to reload. There we go. Hit in the eyes for 11 points. Got some sturdy eyes. Please don't kill Woofer. Please don't kill Woofer. 
Don't kill Woofer. Oh, shit. They stimpacked and shot Woofer. Severely wounded. Well, they're still not almost dead, so I think they could probably take another hit. Oh my god. I hate this gun. They've got to be almost dead now. Almost dead, no. I think I can just use an item on them, right? Yeah, alright. I cannot get there. <laughs> no. This is not going well. Mm. Mm, it's whimpering. Ah, oh, there we go. 17, 17 hit points. That's definitely not max, is it? No, they're still severely wounded. This is really bad. Alright, well, Wolfer's the one who can't take the hits. I, I kind of can. So, shoot him in the head. One target, I think we can deal with this. Just please do not hit Woofer. No! Oh, they missed. Alright. 34 points of damage. Nice. Almost dead. Good. Can I just, like, punch you? Take a swing in the knife? Nah, I don't have enough AP for that. I'm staying right here, then, by Woofer's side. Yes! I think that's it, right? Yeah, we got him! Nice! Good job, Woofer. Okay. Oh my god, yes, 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 yes. That is exactly what I needed, a pistol. Even, that, even if that was the only thing I got, that would still be worth it. A melee weapon that I can sell. Don't know how much it's worth. Cigarettes, stim packs, some more money, sweet. Oh. Good. Actually, let's make a new save just in case for some reason that was a very, very bad idea. But I think it was a very good idea. Alright, let's use that pistol, huh? So let's see, does it have. Do weapons have damage? I don't remember how the damage system works. I think it's based on the round, right? Is The gun doesn't change the damage, but the round does, I think. I don't know. Anyway. Holds 12 shots. Nice. Let's unload this thing. Ah. Okay. How many action points do I have? Hmm. Okay, so I have nine action points. That's a very unfortunate number because it means I can still only shoot once per turn. Yeah. That's not great. Damn. If only I had ten agility, but I went with eight. Shit. I kind of regret that now. This is going to be an okay amount of action points, though, I think. Once I get a sniper rifle or something like that, please don't vomit on me. Maybe they vomited because they saw the bodies. That makes sense. Anyway. Um, once I get a bigger rifle or something like that, I think nine action points will be fine, because I don't think he'd be able to shoot twice anyway, probably. But for a pistol, that's a very bad number, apparently. Hopefully it does more damage, even though I don't think it will, because again, it, the ammo type thing, I don't think the gun makes a difference to damage. Anyway, I need health, but I can't rest. I don't know if moving around on the overworld heals you. Let's test it. Got 16 hit points. So wiggle around a bit till it's daytime. Whoops. Nighttime again. There we go, that's daytime. Alright. Looking better. 
Am I healed? Yeah, partially. Alright. How you looking? Wounded. Let's wiggle around some more. Exciting, isn't it? Okay, that should be enough. Unhurt. Let's take on Alexa. Ooh. Right, they kind of hate me now. I think I only attracted the attention of one, so let's back up. Oh, no, Woofer. Ah, oh, Woofer, don't go over there. Can I... Eh. Hold on. I'm going to tell Wolfer to stay here. Okay. I'm not actually sure how much ammo I have. I think I've got maybe like 15, 20 shots at most. Who? Someone else coming after me? Why is the turn taking so long? Leonard's mercenary used buff out. Oh, they're coming from inside! But not all of them. That's odd. Hmm. I don't think I even have enough ammunition to take them on, do I? Okay, revised plan. <laughs> How much ammunition do I have? Four more plus the what? Twelve in the gun? Yeah, that's not enough. Okay, we're gonna go buy some ammunition. We've got a bunch of stuff to sell, so should be fine. Why don't these people want to... Oh, they do want to kill me. Man, I'm just going to ignore him. Well, that's a little bit hard to ignore. You know, I'm going to go with, like, plan F. Let's not go that way. Let's go this way. The other mercenaries better not try to kill me. No. Good. Okay. Oh shit, that's right. I could probably just tell them who killed Maria and then they'll probably help me, right? That makes sense. <laughs> probably should have done that from the start, but hey, at least I got a cool weapon. Kinda. Before that, though, let's trade some stuff. Got a bunch of junk I don't want. I definitely don't need this piece of crap anymore. Or this. Or that. Or Wait, how much money do you have? Yeah, they got a decent amount of money, plus a crap ton of bullets. Okay. That should do. Armor piercing or... Whatever that is. Probably for flesh, and that's for armor, of course. Hmm. Also got some magazines. Explosives are always fun. Ooh, wow. That's very expensive. 1,000. Nope. How much is a magazine? 1,000. That's a very expensive magazine. I don't know whether these people are heavily armored. Probably not. They're just wearing, like, jackets and stuff. Oh no, is one more expensive than the other? 237. Oh yeah, they are more expensive. Hmm. I'm gonna buy some of these. Yeah. Alright, can I afford one of each? Yeah, what do they need? 35 more? Okay, plenty of ammo. Now 
Not to mention the Maria thing. I know this as well and have known it for much longer than you. Leonard will pay one day for that. No, wait, it wasn't Leonard. It was Alexa, and I can prove it. No way. Alexa? Mm, during my investigation, well, but we already know all this. Blah, blah, blah. Will you help me with her? I can't take on her entire army all by myself. Well, actually, I was just about to. Would have been hard, but I could have done it. I say to comfort myself. <laughs> Alright, come help me. Uh, nothing would please more than personally breaking their neck, but no can, uh, no can do now. We don't have enough medicine, so if we get hit hard, it'll all be over because those bastards will recuperate faster than us. We can't fight. We need you to get those medical, medical supplies first. Get it? How about I just take them on on my own? Forget the medical supplies. I mean, how would I even get the medical supplies without taking them on? Well, shit, I don't want to go that way. I mean, especially now that I've killed some of their mercenaries, now it's absolutely impossible. Yeah. Alright, I'm going to take them all myself. Keep those medical supplies for myself. You're still there, right, Woofer? Yeah. Good boy. Okay, let's switch to the expensive ammunition. I am going to need it. Okay. I don't think I can snipe you from here. I'm just going to get your attention. How about that? Hope to God you're the only one. Man, eh, let's go more this way. Oh yeah, I think I just got their attention. I think it was maybe my gunshot that got everyone else's attention. So let's just lure them over here. One by one, I'll pick them off. Shoot you in the... head. Hell yeah. 17 points of damage. And now they're blind. Still not dead, though. I missed. I'm... I missed shooting a person laying on the ground five feet away. Still not dead? Jesus. Are you serious? Fucking god. How much health do these people have? Maybe I should have gotten that perk that allowed me to see. Please die. Thank god. It's like half my ammo right there. Nearby hostile creatures. Did somebody else hear? What's going on? Uh oh. I think they heard me from inside. I think someone's coming. Someone coming? No, oh, no. Okay, one down, one safe. <laughs> I'm gonna do this one mercenary at a time. I'm taking all this stuff for myself. Who's next? All right, come on, knifey. Don't want to waste ammunition on them being so far away. Hmm, yeah. Ow. 
Oh no, old man shambling away and someone else is coming. 24 points, nice. Stimpak, damn you. Oof, that did a lot of damage actually. Missed. I'm gonna have to heal after this. Woof woof. Help me, woofer. Actually, I'm almost dead. Do I risk it? I'm gonna risk it. Come on. You gotta be so close to dead. Just severely wounded. Mm, okay, I'm not dead. Whew. For the love of God. Almost dead and has crippled limbs. I got a stim pack. I got a double stim pack. Well, at least they missed. Alright, she's running. Get her. I shouldn't have shot her head, but I got lucky. I'm gonna be careful with you. I'm gonna get some distance. I can outrun them, right? Uh, by like one tile. Ah, screw it. God, I can't wait till I get a rifle. <laughs> I thought I'd be super happy with this pistol, but I'm not. He's got a sledgehammer, he kicks me. I guess it didn't have the AP to use it. Ah! This is gonna be one hell of a triumph when I actually do this. I'm gonna do it. Even though they just used a stim pack. Another one down. Another one bites the dust. I'm probably gonna have to make a trip back to the gun store and sell that stuff. Buy some more rounds. Let's see, how many do I have left? Oh, whoops. I mean, I know I have normal rounds, but I want armor piercing. Three shots of armor piercing loaded and that's it. But then I've got 40 of these shots. Maybe I'll just use them. Yeah, alright. What? No. What? Oh. Okay. Oh, I need to wiggle around a bit. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. I remember doing this so much when I was playing this game. Uh, I'm, when I was playing the original Fallout 2. Just so many silly things where I like picked off enemies one by one and just spent forever just rehealing myself and stuff. You can do almost anything if you set your mind to it. Even if you're like totally under leveled, like you can just reload as many times as you need to get the crits that you need to survive or something like that. You can probably make it happen. It just takes time. Okay, I think that's all the people outside. Yes, good. Do I want Wolf Woofer to come with me? I don't know. I think they're just going to die. They're a distraction, but I think they'll die. Mm. Let's give him a shot.
Oop, someone saw me. Who? Is that Alexa? I think that might be Alexa. Yeah, that is Alexa. Well, shit, if I could get just her, that'd be fantastic. I'm just gonna back up. Please tell me it's just her. Oh my god, we got just her. Friggin' perfect. Oh, doggy. Chill, doggy, chill. Uh, pass another turn? Hope Woofer doesn't go crazy. Hope Woofer's not going inside the building, no. Good. Now I hope Alexa doesn't start attacking. Oh, fuck. What? Oh my god! She just killed me. <laughs> I wondered what that screaming was. She just sniped me with, what the hell was that, like a desert eagle or something? Hmm. Okay, I've gotten myself into a position where I think I can probably take her on. So I critted her once in the eyes, so she's blinded, um, she's severely wounded, and I just healed myself up by using some healing powders, which unfortunately, I, I, I totally forgot I had them, but unfortunately they reduced my perception. Uh, I'm not quite sure what that's going to do to my ability to shoot, but I think I can probably tank one shot as long as she doesn't crit me. So, here we go. Please don't kill me. Oh, she had her turn passed over. That's good. I'm going to get close, so it gives me a better chance to hit her. Ooh, my lord perception looks to have made my ability to hit much shittier. She's severely wounded. What do I go for? The head? Did she just... No, she's stim-packed. Does that heal their crippled limbs as well? No, she's still crippled. Okay, and she's still wounded, so... Yeah, I still definitely stand a chance. Mm, I'm gonna heal again. Did I just... What did I just do? I just... Oh, I just looked at the bag. What? No, d Oh, fuck. That's bad. Well, there goes more of my perception. <clears throat> did she miss? Junkie was hit for 24 points and was killed. What the? Who did? Huh? Who did she just shoot? She just murdered a junkie somewhere. Where? What? Okay. Sorry, junkie. I'm gonna basically have to be standing, like, right in front of her face to hit her with my crappy perception now. Christ, look at this. I'm literally standing in front of her and I have a 25% chance to hit her eyes. Ugh. Let's go over the head. Come on. Missed. No. Mm. Oh, they missed too. Good. Good, good, good. Come on. Missed again. Alright, I'll get behind you. Haha, -ha, confused. No, that didn't work. Dare I take another healing powder? I guess. I think I've got like negative 50 perception now. Ooh, this restores health, right? Gained three hit points. Well, something. Oh my god, I'm just gonna hit her in the torso, I guess. Ten hit points. You have to be so close to dead. Severely wounded. She's not even almost dead yet. This is not looking good. Whoa! Did that kid just throw something at her? Thanks, kid. Wow. Right, well, there's no way I'm gonna really do this if I hit her in the head. I think I have to go for a lucky shot in the eyes. Okay, please don't hit me. Ah, that was such a good attempt. Okay, now's my chance again. I'm in a similar situation. She's crippled, shot her in the eyes. Um, but I had to take a couple healing powders, so my perception is terrible. But if I can just get a lucky shot off. Let's go for the head. Come on. Don't stim pack. No. I think it's over. 
Gonna go for the eyes. Mm, 28 points of damage. She's almost dead. Okay, wait, 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 wait. She's almost dead. I can do this. She probably doesn't have another stim pack. I'm gonna heal all the way up again. My perception is terrible, but... She has another stim pack! Ah, uh, she's still severely wounded. She could miss. She didn't miss, but she didn't do that much damage. Alright, keep going for the eyes. Come on, come on, come on. I missed again. Fuck. She missed? Yeah, she missed. Okay, good. This is just pathetic. Uh. Okay, here we go, here we go. I think this might work. Um, similar situation to before, but the main difference is that I took, um, I took Wolfer with me. I set their combat mode to stay close to me instead of going off on their own, so they didn't attract the attention of anyone else. And now, Alexa is actually focused on Wolfer. Which makes me a little bit sad, but it's very good, actually, because now I can actually survive. It's being a bit of a punching bag for now. Unfortunately, I did have to take a couple healing powders, so my accuracy is garbage. But uh, let's go for the eyes. Did I just... Oh no, I missed and I hit Woofer. Woofer's not doing much. I don't think they have much health left, either. Uh, let's go for the head. That didn't do much damage. Severely wounded. How are you doing? Almost dead! Oh no. Oh, that's bad. That's really bad. Oh no, they're running away. They're so hurt. And I just shot Woofer. <sighs> Ooh! Critically hit for 56 hit points. And she fainted. I think she's gonna stay fainted for a while. Almost dead. Oh, we got her. We got her, Woofer. You got her, Woofer. Got her. Get him, Woofer. <laughs> yes, finally. Oh. Did it all on my own. And of course, with Wolfer's help, did it all on our own. Didn't need the help of that asshole. I hope she dropped her gun. Yes, Desert Eagle! And that's probably the key to the medical supplies, I'm assuming. Some drugs, some ammunition, couple stim packs. Beautiful. Just take all. Is this what goes in the Desert Eagle? Oh yeah, it is. Alright. Well, let's use that thing, huh? Put this pistol in here as a backup weapon. Holds eight shots. Ancient Desert Eagle pistol, 44 Magnum. Interesting, late 20th century films made this one of the most popular handguns of all time. Desert Eagle facts. How are you doing, Woofer? You're probably almost dead, huh? Severely wounded. Yeah, let's go wiggle around on the overworld for a bit. Still got a couple more goons to take on, but with this weapon, and not having to take, take on Alexa, the freaking Desert Eagle sniper, I think we should be fine. Alright, that should probably do it. How you looking now? Unhurt. Perfect. Yeah, I think the rest of them just have melee weapons. So with this Desert Eagle, this should not be a problem. I just need to get their attention. I can't even see their outlines. Hmm. Just peek my head in here. Oh, wait. Oh! I think because I left the map and came back, and because Alexa was killed, they all abandoned the place. There's someone in here, is there? No? Oh, there's a manhole. That's right, there's supposed to be some sort of subterranean place, right? That's where I um, thought that Leonard was actually staying. Well, of course, we learned that he's actually dead. Or perhaps the medical supplies are down there. 
Okay, cool. Free rain of the place. What's this? Desk? Nothing? Exciting. I see there's not much for reading. Is that like the entire- oh my god, that's the entire shop's supplies, isn't it? Whoa! Money! Antidotes! Healing powders! Nuka-Cola! This is a lot of supplies. And a freaking leather jacket, I think I finally have armor. Take it all. What about here? Is there even more? Oh, looks like that's it. I guess I should probably put on the armor, huh? Does this say how many armor points? It doesn't say, but it actually, the stats change. So yeah, right now I have zero protection from everything because I'm not wearing armor. Uh, it takes my armor class from 8 to 16, whatever that means, and it gives me... 20, 20, 10, 10, 20 protection. Okay, cool. my weight, by the way. I'm only 71 out of 110. Alright. It's gotta be a spare magazine or something, right? Blue package condom. Jerky and cigarettes. Probably need to use the key on this, or perhaps the manhole. Nope, this one. If only my lockpick skill was decent. I'm assuming the key that opened the door wouldn't work on these, right? That does nothing. Yeah, that didn't work. All right, I can try my lockpick skill, but it's 16%. So, yeah. I think you just keep trying this until at some point it like breaks or something because you suck so much. But there's a chance every time you do it that it can work, I think. I mean, at some point I just have to accept it's just really isn't gonna work. I think it's a crit maybe it's a critical failure that causes it to break. Okay, starting to get bored. Starting to wonder whether there is a chance I can actually pick it. I'm pretty sure there is. I don't think this game works with lock picking as like just a like a level check where either you have enough or you don't. Pretty sure it's just a percent chance, but I'm starting to doubt that. Yeah. Do the other one for good luck, maybe. No, one more time. Okay, that was exciting. Let's go down. <sighs> Supplies. Oh, please don't tell me this is locked, too. Good. Pfft. I mean, I could sell it, but I thought something more exciting would be inside of that. Ammo crate? Ammo? Ammo? That's not ammo. Still, that's awesome. Some rad away, more stims. Rad X, nice. Wow, I'm all suited up. If I want to go to a kind of radiation zone, got a couple rad things. Rad removal and rad protection. That was incredibly fruitful. I'm so well. Uh, I'm so well equipped compared to how I was when I first came here with my one round pistol and no armor. I've got a bunch of stuff. Okay, well, um, let's go sell a bunch of this stuff at the gun store. Let's go mention the fact that I sort of saved the town, I guess. 
and see what Julian thinks of it. Yeah, let's finish up this town. Wait, where's Woofer? Oh, there you are. Just being a slow doggy. It's okay. Now, can I just, like, kill Julian? And then maybe in the power vacuum, the town will become some perfect wasteland utopia? Mm, probably not. Finally, they're dead. Thanks for the help. You did me and this town a great favor. Still one unsolved mystery. Where the hell is that motherfucking Leonard? Hmm. Apparently I'm having a revelation. I think Leonard's been dead for a while, even though we already knew that was a fact. Mm-hmm. 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 Help a lot. Go to the weapons storehouse and take whatever you can carry. It's all yours. Really? Thanks. Holy shit. Well, let's go there first. Is it here? What have you got for me? Nice. I'd love a rifle. Although it's probably wishing for a little bit too much. I doubt I'll find one at this stage of the game. Dude, come on, you said I can take what I want. Just gonna leave him locked? Ooh, a couple almost hidden ammo crates. Oh, some more Desert Eagle ammo. Well, that's no good to me, but I can sell it for a lot of money. Just those two, right? Let me make sure I don't miss anything. I think so. Okay, let's try just a couple more times, huh? <sighs> Alright, fine. Yeah, I really am going to put points into lockpick at some point, and I believe you can also at some point find um, a lockpick, like a lockpick set that increases your lockpick skill by, I don't know, 10 or 20%. So I will be able to lockpick stuff, because I think it's a pretty important skill. There's a lot of locked things, even in Fallout 2. Alright, let's sell this garbage. Well, some of it, actually. They don't have that much money. Let's try to get rid of the heaviest stuff. That's probably heavy. Don't need those. Don't think I need a condom. What does Nuka-Cola do? Warm and flat. <laughs> does it give you any bonuses? I think if you drink it, it gives you the bottle cap from it, so you can, like, you gain one monies. But as far as stat changes, I don't know. I guess I'll keep Antidote, I guess I'll keep that. Don't feel like I need any melee weapons at this point. Wait, what am I doing? I don't even think they have enough money for this. They don't, but I could buy some more ammunition. What do I have, like 40 shots? 38? I mean, I wouldn't mind more. I don't know if I have enough stuff. Let me see if I have enough stuff to get like a magazine or something. Like what about the weapon? Where's, where's my pistol? And cigarettes, too. It's worth a good amount. Pistol's probably worth a very good amount. Just about a straight thousand. Okay. Yeah, that's actually almost perfect for a magazine or a bomb. Hmm. What do we want more, a magazine or a bomb? <laughs> I think I'll read a magazine. That plus... 
uh, 150, 160? Exactly? Yeah. Okay. Good, good. I don't actually know how much that increases your skill either. Let's see. So, small guns, 97%. You learn nothing new? Did I just say you learn nothing new? I just wasted like a thousand caps. Did I just save over my game? No, I didn't. Thank God. Okay, hold on. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm just going to clean them all out of money. I'm not going to buy a magazine because apparently I can't learn anything from it. And I think I'll hold off on buying a bomb for now. I'll save my money. Just got rid of some of my garbage. Let's see, is there anything else to talk about? Nope, that's just trading again. Hmm. Work. Work. Do you have any work for me? Nope. Alright, looks like we are completely done with this town. Alright, cool. Blood with bones. What was that? See nothing out of the ordinary. Oh, you know what? Hold on, before I leave, I should probably go speak with uh, George. See if there's anything new to say. She can live in peace. Maria's murderer is dead. Was it Alexa? What happened? Yep. Re-explain this for the thousandth time. What happened? Did you kill her? Yep. Thank you. I hope dogs tear a disgusting body apart. A thousandfold thanks. Finally, I can spend the rest of my life with peace in my soul. He wheezes and slowly heads to the graveyard. <laughs> I mean, he's probably going to the graveyard to um, go to the grave of his daughter, but uh, it kind of sounds like he's also going to join her in the grave. <laughs> this is a, a cutscene, apparently. Now, okay, I'm kind of grimly curious. I'm going to go to the grave. I wonder if he's going to be there. Yeah, he is there. Thanks for everything you've done for me, now I can die in peace. I don't think there's any reason to go speak with the doctor. But just in case, I'll go pay him a super quick visit. Okay. Alright, we are officially done with this town. Cool. Well, that was hard as hell, trying to take out those slugs completely on my own. I certainly made that hard for myself, but it felt really satisfying. I've got a bunch of really nice equipment now. I think I can officially say that we're now past the really hard part of the game. Like I said at the start, the very start of any Fallout game is typically pretty crappy because you got terrible equipment, your accuracy is garbage. I think I'm over the hump. My accuracy still isn't great, but I've got a pretty good weapon, and I've got some armor, and some equipment, and some money. So I'm feeling pretty good about this. Alright, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, we're going to head over to Set It, and see if we can pick up on some more leads about this talisman that I have. <laughs>